hey, what's the deal? What's the deal? What's the deal? Your boy LB, back with another one of them thing things, mate. One time for the one time, you know what it is up over here, eh? Check it out, though. Check it out. Today, today, my nigga, we got Damo Wilson with I Wish I Never Met You. I know a lot of y'all was looking like, I know this nigga LB did not do this. Hold on, hold on, hold on. My baby mama is a fan of these two chicks. I guess they had a YouTube channel. One of them was a stud chick, got pregnant, break up, whatever, with a little bit. I don't know what's going on, but you know what I'm saying? She kind of pinned a nigga in the corner, like, not really pinned a nigga in the corner, but she was like, Babe, I want you to do this reaction. And I was like, well, so, so, so. Then she was like, well, if you be doing them subscribers reactions, you could do at least one of mine. So I'm like, you know what? You're right. So here we are. Damo Wilson, wish I never met you. Let's see what it do. Let's bring it to the motherfucking stage. Oh, you don't want to play, huh? Why do bitches lie so much? I really try to figure that shit out and I, I really can't figure it out. Why fucking lie? Dumbass bitch. Should I left you where I met you, bitch? You fucked up. You hit the jackpot with me, bitch. You lucked up. But you wanna know. Quick question. First off, she coming off angry. Well, not kind of angry, but she mad, bruh. Um, but quick, quick question, quick question, quick question. So from what I gather from what my BM told me, these is two lesbian chicks, right? And one of them used to be kind of femish, and she turned stud because the other girl wanted her to turn stud, and the stud one was the one that had the baby and this, that, and the third, and documented the whole thing, and then they had a little breakup, and now supposedly the other girl's fucking with some other girl, which is who they wanted to do right is supposed to be. My thing is this, bruh. What the fuck does that got to do with rapping? Are they rappers or are they you YouTubers? Or are they both? I'm I'm still trying to figure it out, bro. The bitches got me fucked up, but you got me over here screaming fuck love. You love me and I see it in your eyes though. I was dumb enough believing all your lies, ho. Said she was just a friend, but now she in your thighs, yo. I tried to turn a fucking hoe into a wife, bro. Damn bitch, you fucked up bad. Gonna be ringing on my phone when you see what you had, and I'm a block, scared, deleted, and say oops, my bad. And when she fucking breaks your heart, I hope you cry and you sad. I hope she uses you for money, hope she sucks you dry. I hope she leaves you in the tell you you want. She sound real bitter, bruh. Like, see, I don't, I don't really know the inner workings or, or that whole little relationship. Cause look, let's, let's keep it a thousand, bro. We already know a lot of this shit that be on the not saying that they story is, but I already know a lot of this shit that be on YouTube, especially these little vlogs when they be having their personal life, like all up. A lot of this, sh I think, be for views and all that or whatnot, but. I don't think that's what this about, but I really think that she like too deep in her feelings, bro. Like for real, for real. Come on, let's go. I got some more shit to say, but come on. Understand why I hope she texting other bitches while you laying at night. I hope you crying every day while she playing your life. Blind. Everybody told me what it was, but I ain't fucking listen because I thought I was in love. I wish I never met you, bitch. You fucking kill my buds. You ain't have a fucking reason. You play me because you could. I was blind. Everybody told me what it was, but I ain't fucking listen because I thought I was in love. I wish I never met you, bitch. You fucking kill my buds. You ain't have a fucking reason. You play me because you could, you fucking bitch. Don't and talk your shit. So she is mad. Man, yeah, yeah. So let me ask y'all a question. Say you dealing with somebody and um, you dealing with somebody, you put them on or saying you step their game up, put them on to the upper echelon, this, that, and the third. Would you give this person the satisfaction of seeing you hurt and angry or would you just like, you know what? Been there, done that. Let's move on. Cause I understand uh, you hurt. You want to get this off your chest, you want to vent this, that, and the third. But at the same time, if the other person has moved on with their life, is it like worth it at the end of the day? Let me know. 
ain't do a thing for you, girl, you soft as shit. Stop fucking walk around bougie like you bought the shit. I fucking gave you what you got, bitch, you off as shit. Switch it up when you got your own girl and me alone. Say you grown, playing on my phone, end up alone. Cause every time that I come over, you be trying to fuck. But you got a girlfriend, bitch, you wild as fuck. I don't trust you. Look at what you doing to your girl. You showing her off for trying to lick my pearl. And when I fucking decline, you claim that she's your world. And how you never ever felt this with no other girl, bitch. How do you hope? I really wanted to be proud of you, ho They see your colors cause your attitude, ho You never show no fucking gratitude, yo With all the fake shit, girl, you ain't shit You don't make shit, I'm patient Cause karma coming for you when I waited You get you smoking now, girl, like then you changing Your face is like what you want, girl, you acting basic You waste it from every Friday to every Monday You taint it, hoping you change, girl, like maybe someday you race it Cause what we had, girl, it wasn't nothing You said I was so easy to get up, but bitch, you front, ho blind, everybody t- she a lot of bitches, a lot of hoes, a lot of sluts, and this, that, and the third. But look, I ain't another, another question. Because we all grown up over here, all right? Right? So, when you get cheated on, let me just give my personal perspective, my personal shit. Smell what I'm saying? When you going through something with someone, me personally, if the situation already seems iffy, if it's any poison, I don't, I don't care if I've been fucking with you for two, three, four, five years. If it get to the point to where we're back and forth, we bickering this, that, and the third, and I gotta constantly check your phone, and I gotta constantly ask you, ask you shit, I gotta constantly stalk your Instagram and your IG and all this, constantly watch, watch your Snapchat, constantly look who come, like, like if, like, that's too much of a headache, you feel what I'm saying? I should just, like, 86 is situation right then and there. So my thing is, when it comes to these um these relationships and shit like that, personally, well, in this relationship, personally, I just really don't think even let's let's just say she really did want to do music or her whole plan from the gate was to do music. Let's just say it was that. I don't think her giving this other girl the platform is the way to go. You smell what I'm saying? If you over her, you over her. You know what I'm saying? Smell. That's what I'm saying. You move on. If you over it, you over it. That is what it is, right? Don't sit and give this person a platform like that. This person shine off what you're doing. Cause like like I just said, at the end of the day, you the only one sitting back looking stupid. Like true, you getting your chalupas, you getting your views, you getting this, you getting that. But at the same time, if you really sitting back feeling this hurt because you really going through this, it's like it's not working. Move on. Told me what it was, but I ain't fucking listen Cause I thought I was in love I wish I never met you, bitch, you fuck my buds You ain't have a fucking reason You play me because you could, I was blind Everybody told me what it was But I ain't fucking listen Cause I thought I was in love I wish I never met you, bitch, you fucking kill my buds You ain't have a fucking reason You play me because you could, you, you say I'm weird bitch. Somebody come get this weird bitch for some years Everybody already know we together And you got me out here looking dumb Cause I'm staying with your ass. These bitches laughing at me. What bitches? I'm gonna look at my bitches. I sent you screenshots up. You know what bitches I'm talking about. The big phone. I fucking went through your shit. I seen him. Guess the lesbian couples go through the same shit straight couples go through, huh? The exact same shit. I guess with them it's a little more emotional because you got two women involved and that shit is like, eh. Just Jesus. Myself. Yeah, you ain't know I knew about that shit, did you? You wanna see the screenshots? My face oh, I can't wait to see you. You look so beautiful. Meet me at the movies. Who the fuck you going to the movies with? Exactly. You got me out here looking fucking dumb for your ass. Bitch, fuck you. You said. That was probably the most fire part of the video, bruh. That was probably the most fire part of the video. She. It's like I feel where she coming from. I understand it. Smell what I'm saying? But it's like. I just felt you should have moved on with your life, baby girl. <coughs> it's like you still got your heart on your sleeve and this, that, and the third. And not to say the video is corny, it's not really corny, it's just. I'm lost, I guess. Not really. Lo I don't know, maybe because I don't watch the YouTube channel, I don't fucking know, but continue with third of the action. You felt nothing, bitch, you ain't shit, bitch, cheers. 
to you if you had one You really are the mad one Texting me you hate me and your new girl is amazing And you gonna have a baby and she moving in this crazy Woo! Back with her a week later That's foul But I'm not gonna do shit cause karma coming around While I'm catching fights and booking shit You bumming around I will be happy But you treat me like a bum on the ground You said that you would never do you too with another You been acting fucking shady ever since is that's what this about? So that's what it's about. Cause I yell bang head and then you fell left. That that's what this about. Some YouTube. Sh Is this what this really? I really hope not. I, I will bring my baby mom on camera, but she don't want to be on camera and shit just yet. But um, I think me and her will have to have a conversation, bruh. Yeah. You got a lover and you claiming that you love her and you putting her out. Don't be surprised when she leave you when she get all the clout. I was blind. Everybody told me what it was, but I ain't fucking listen. Thought I was in love. I wish I never met you, bitch. You fucking kill my bud. You ain't have a fucking reason. You play me because you could. I was blind. Everybody told me what it was, but I ain't fucking listen because I thought I was in love. I, wish I never met you, bitch. You fucking kill my bud. You ain't have a fucking reason. You play me because you could, you fucking bitch. Never again will I ever lose myself in no relationship. If you can't commit, if you don't like me how I am, then bitch, fuck you. Go to somebody on your level. Because <laughs> you ain't on mine. All right, so my whole question is this, too. Also, the baby. Is the baby being and all this shit. See, it's so many questions I got because I don't like as I said before, I never watched this YouTube channel, so I already know what's going on with these two bro. I mean, I'm gonna shut these two bro. Excuse me, these two chicks. I don't I don't really know what's going on. You smell what I'm saying? So I didn't catch up, keep up with this one. You know what I'm saying just sort of the action. My baby mama want me to do because she watched this. Shit. So I'm gonna have to talk to her and figure this shit out because I don't understand this, bro. Because there's so many questions I got. For one, I just really don't think she should have gave. If you done with old girl, don't give her a platform. Smell what I'm saying? If you done with old girl, don't worry about what she put you through, what you been through, or like it's it's. I've learned through my experiences living in the past, especially when you're trying to move on with your life, living living in the past. It's not gonna work because you're never gonna be able to move forward. And also, at the end of the day, it's like you have no future if you're still tied up to your past, especially if you have them unanswered questions. You feel what I'm saying? Hold on. Especially if you got them unanswered questions, you feel what I'm saying? So it's like. I just don't think she should have did that. I think she should have came out with a whole different song. Because first of all, the video was... Nah, nah. And the song was cool, especially for what I'm assuming her just coming out as rapping. It was cool, but I just think the video was could have been done better. Especially if you're pouring your emotions out. I just think it could have been done better. You smell what I'm saying? But it is what it is at the end of the day. But anyway, though, scrape y'all that. Scrape y'all that. Let me know what y'all think about that, man. Get in the comment box, like, subscribe to the YouTube channel, man. Tell a friend to tell a friend, subscribe to the YouTube channel. You rocking with, what the fuck is this chick? I don't even know this chick name. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. LB for what's the deal. And I'm gone. Two. Huh. Better do your time for that burner. Niggas doing time for that murder. Follow all the pills, but if I fail, niggas stand on side for that murder. Gang.